that is true, I'm obsessed with nature. So, hi everyone, I'm Callie Northig, and with the incredible Donald Pliner himself, thanks again for taking the time to be with us tonight. No, thanks, and one of the things we were just talking about, how, thank God, there's so many of you that shop HSN, but for the new ones at first time, it's a whole new excitement, it's a whole new service, it's a whole new world of yeah. shopping. Yep, it really is. So many people have comments tonight flipping by and I'm like, oh, Donald Pliner. So come back often and stay with us because this is another, we have two final styles tonight. The veil being another, I think is gonna be a huge hit, um, particularly because the color options are so fantastic. And then wait till we show you some of the in inset detailing. Um, this we have in the, there's a black suede, there's the garnet with this beautiful burnished and embossed uh, snakeskin insert. And then here is the chestnut. So speaking of which, we don't have a lot of two of, of the garnet or the, the chestnut. So uh, first come, first serve there in sizes six through uh, 10, whole and half sizes, medium width. So this one is really and, and this with is that great heel. All elastic Ooh, goring. Look at that. So you just put your foot into it and it Hold you from that point on. Look at that. Whoa, that's fantastic. See all that stretch? Wow, that is workmanship, craftsmanship. That is incredible material. Now, the architectural heel again, isn't that beautiful? We're showing this to be about a three and a half inch stacked leather heel, but really architectural, sculptural, as you said. Right, it's, it's, um, it's something that we've started using for a while. It started in one place and has just become even more important no matter what the height. But they actually, it's, it's beautiful because from the back, when you look at it that way, it looks like a skinny little heel. From the side, you get all the support that's really necessary and that's really one of the keys. But look how sexy it is from the back. It looks like a little like skinny stiletto. It does, you're right, whoa. So here's the garnet. Oh my gosh, this color is this, That's great. This insane. whole brush distress, this is fabulous, this color. Wow. It's always a color that we've always done over the years, and it's always been extremely, people say, well, what am I going to wear it with? Say to yourself what you're not going to wear it with. Hmm. Yeah, and it's one of the strongest colors of the season for sure. This whole family of the garnets and the eggplants, isn't that something else? That is, oh, this finishing touches on this leather is just, it's beyond. And then that embossed detailing on, did you see this part, ladies? The stretch. So this is how you get in and out of your shoe, no problem whatsoever. Um, we don't have as many as I wish we did. In fact, right now we have more people on sh online shopping than what we even have in inventory. It's been a busy <laughs> hour with Donald tonight. So take advantage of your color and your size before it goes. That is the most disappointing thing when it happens. So here it is on the foot. Wow. Beautiful, isn't it? And I think what you're seeing is on the foot, but you're seeing skirts, you're seeing pants. Again, there is no limitations of how you can wear a little boot today. I mean, ready to wear has suddenly become so brand exciting and so new that the, the limitations are, there are no limitations. The limitations is yourself. That gorgeous garnet we just saw in Hita in the skirt, we have six through nine only. So again, getting super limited. The saddle or the chestnut in this case, beautiful color. It's a little bit deeper. Uh, it's, it's almost like a mm, caramel. I don't know, it's hard to come up with the best descriptive word because it is just so rich and- it's Very South Dakota. <laughs> it is, isn't it? You really do need to go see that part of the country. You should take Lisa. Well, I did a collection years ago and in the, uh, in, um, in, um, in the Las Vegas, in, in Las Vegas, in the, um, in the... Are we talking about a city? No, in Vegas where the uh, waterfalls and everything like this. Oh, Caesars? No. Oh, 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 oh I know, the, um, the shopping area. <laughs> no, the... no, no, not in the city. The actual mountains, the, um, oh my the God. The Red Rocks? No. No, okay, just we'll keep talking. Okay, we move on. <laughs> what? I, I've hiked those mountains. No, 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 no. In, in Nevada itself. In Nevada, yes, I've hiked those mountains. When you take the helicopter rides and you go to see it. Um, not, oh. not Sedona. No, 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 Arizona. We're I not know, in Arizona, no. we're in Nevada. <laughs> anyway, it was fabulous. Uh, but everyone's I did a whole laughing at us. There. Help us. <laughs> I've hiked those mountains, okay. We'll come up with it, of course, after we say, sign off tonight. In either case, I know what you're saying, though. It's like the clay colors of the of the deserts. In either case, 4360911. We kept digging ourselves deeper and deeper and deeper into that problem. Okay, garnet, one dozen left. So good luck there. We've got the chestnut and the black.